All right, hello everyone. This is a word I just got a few moments ago. Um, I don't know, it's about noon on uh, March 16th. And, uh, you know, I, I just want to share that, you know, we see a lot of people, you know, prophesying and saying they've gotten words from the Lord and, <clears throat> um, I just think that, you know, we all need to be careful, including myself, um, to just discern the spirits and, you know, as in 1 John 4, any spirit that does not confess Jesus Christ came to earth in flesh and blood as a man is not of God, but of Antichrist. <clears throat> so I always say a prayer along those lines. And I just hope, uh, you know, everyone else is doing the same. So this is the word that I, I just received. In the name of Jesus Christ, my son who came to earth in flesh and blood as the image of the invisible God, <clears throat> my children shall be kept from the time of trouble. As it is written, you shall meet your Lord in the air. Be diligent, my children, standing, staying at the ready, on guard, putting on the full armor of God, trusting and abiding in, walking in righteousness, truth and faith. Be the light, walking accordingly, obedient, doing the will of your heavenly Father. Seeing with your eyes to see my revelation, listening with your ears to hear, taking in my word, and what is revealed unto you. My sheep hear my voice, and they know me. Is it my voice you are hearing? Are you discerning? Have you read my word? For there are many false prophets and lying spirits seeking to devour my children and lead them astray. Stay close, my children, praying fervently and in faith, testing the spirits and rebuking the enemy in the name of Jesus Christ. Resist, and he will flee. Let your faith ever so increase in these final days, for you, my children, will move mountains. <laughs> All right, and I'm being filled with the Holy Spirit. <clears throat> God is amazing. So I'm just going to put um, 1 John 4 in the description box. And again, I just encourage everyone, and if you haven't, come to know the Lord and or if you do know the Lord just to really seek him and stay close and uh, you know uh, read his word and uh, I think I'll also put a link to the Version Bible app that I like in the description box as well and uh, if you haven't read the Bible I always suggest reading Romans first then John then the Gospels then Acts Jude and Revelation, then the rest of the New Testament, and then uh, the Old Testament. And just seek the Lord, people. He's coming. All right. God bless everyone in the name of Jesus Christ.